So in a very real sense, this is where it all started. The birch bark canoe and the uh, indigenous peoples here in the state of Maine and all through New England. Uh, one of the first boats. So here we have a Penobscot a Wabanaki built birch bark canoe. Uh, and when was she built? This one was built in 2006. So we've got one of the newest ones. Um, the art form is still alive, which is great. And um, the next gener generation is learning how to build the birch bark canoe. Um, and if you want to talk about local materials, materials it, this is it. We've mm -hmm. got the birch, we've got the cedar ribs, the spruce roots for lashing. Um, and traditionally the bare fat or beeswax and yeah for the waterproofing yep. so this one this guy here was really built as a recreational boat the first the first thing that will give it away is that look at all the varnish yeah you know and then and then we've seen very few in fact i don't think i don't think i've seen any pea pods that had anything looking like a centerboard trunk or something, like any working pods. I don't think there has been any evidence of them. Uh, so in this case, in this case, they put a daggerboard trunk in yep. and a fairly crude daggerboard. But this is pure recreational, right? Pure recreational stuff, but yet very nicely built. I mean, we're still looking at look, look at look at the knee structures in here. Yeah, uh, all riveted. I mean, this is very high end. Yep. This is this was very high end boat building. Look, look at the way that's built in here. And then the, you can see in here. This is a different way of dealing with the stand up oarlock situation. So, you know, we we were looking at some bronze ones. Uh, I don't have I don't have any pipe, pipe with uh, oarlocks in them. I've built them, but, uh, but look at. You can see this, see this guy here. Mm -hmm. So we have a plank here with an orlock fastened to the top and the plank with a setup like so. And this guy here basically drops in through the in whale and the out whale. Right there. Mm -hmm. 